Bob Mills Weather Center. Meteorologist Aaron Reeves. Well, it's been a rainy day. Most locations picking up rain anywhere from around a tenth of an inch to an inch. Tulsa 0.6, Pawnee 1 inch. The Mezzanet site in Skytooks picked up 1.2 inches. Uh, and as we take a look at what's going on right now, we have rain basically across kind of the, the eastern, well, northeastern half of the viewing area. This is likely going to be the heaviest rain we see out of this. Uh, we'll see lingering showers and wraparound moisture, but probably not quite as heavy as what's been falling out there the past hour or two. Uh, as you can see, this continuing the pinwheel around that low and we'll see it off and on during the night. So we have a big area of moderate rain basically across northern Osage County that extends back down into the Tulsa area. Notice as you head out to the west, we get a break uh, east of Tulsa. We're seeing light rain uh, across much of far northeastern Oklahoma from Miami down towards Salem Springs, Shakota and Eufaula, an area of moderate rain and then that area of light rain extends further back towards Tallahena and on into uh, LaFleur and McCurtain County uh, at this point in time and off to the west, you know, uh, a little bit drier but as this low moves east we'll eventually get wraparound moisture but once again it'll probably be a little bit on the lighter side but we may see a break during the overnight hours and into tomorrow morning before that picks back up uh, and the chances of rain on sunday still really pretty high another system passes nearby wednesday night into thursday a lot of this may end up being just off to our east and then another system just beyond the scope of this on sunday highs today lower 60s 50s up into kansas Pretty warm down into Texas where we did see some 70s. Right now we're still at 51, 55 in Dallas. Cold, but not horribly cold up into the Dakotas. That's really kind of balmy by their standards and temperatures 40 below or colder in portions of Alaska. This isn't heading our way anytime soon, although I think as we head towards the second half of the month, we may see some pattern changes that allow some colder air to get down here. Not, not anything like that, but certainly colder. We'll see a brief cool down Sunday on the back side of the system, but we'll quickly warm back up thanks to this being more of a Pacific air mass, no Canadian or, or Arctic air with it. And then as we head toward the middle of the month, that pattern might change and we may see temperatures generally be below normal for a good chunk of time. Uh, we do have, once again, gloomy, rainy conditions, 51 light easterly winds, and those will become more northerly as time goes on. Uh, quite out west right now, but once again, rain in our area, temperatures across the state, 40s to 50s. And as we head into the overnight hours, notice not much change by around one, but then we start to see wraparound moisture on the back side of this, a short thermometer tomorrow, still some lingering showers at noon, going into the afternoon, once again, only topping out in the lower 50s, but with north winds, it could be, it could be a lot colder if Canadian air was involved with this. 38 Monday morning, and then with clearing skies, nice conditions, Monday afternoon, light winds, looks pretty nice upper 50s to mid 50s and then we're back into the 60s as we head towards uh, the middle of the week and beyond as this ridging occurs and this high pressure moves in and then this system arrives as we head towards Thursday but I think a lot of the moisture with this may end up being just off to our east will remain warm and then going beyond that another system on its heels just in time for the following Sunday and then behind that one, we may get some uh, slightly cooler air in here, maybe some 40s and 50s for highs at some point uh, there toward the middle of the month, or maybe a couple of colder days than that. As we look through the rest of the week, though, rainy still tomorrow, and then we warm back up. And really a pretty nice week, just a lot like last week uh, as we head through the bulk of the upcoming week. So that was a look at weather. Let's take a look at what's going on in sports.